Have you ever wondered what it's like to be poor? Well, most of us are fortunate enough that we don't even have to worry about it. There are just shadows in our busy lives. I'm pretty sure most of us take for granted simple things that we just must have, such as iPods, cell phones, cars, and even the homes we come home to every day. Well, this story, Breakfast at Sally's, is truly inspirational, showing the rags to riches story of Richard. Richard had everything. On weekends, he enjoyed long days of playing golf. I wish I had a one of cash. I throw it in a ham, take a cab, and that roll out the Richard loved taking trips worldwide. He also enjoyed exquisite meals from all over. Richard also helped out the poor. And you ask me what I want this year And I try to make this kind and clear Just a chance that maybe we'll find better days Cause I don't need boxes wrapped in strings And desire to love and empty things Just a chance that maybe we'll find Time when the rich became poor and forced to live in a car. Who will survive? New York Times says, reads like a novel, but it has a ring of truth and an uplifting message that endures. Once I started this book, I couldn't put it down. Captain Howard Binet, Salvation Army. An important book, a vivid, honest peek into a world we rarely see. Nan Roman, President and CEO of National Alliance and Homelessness. Bye-bye.